Hi, if you're watching this video, you're probably interested in how to take effective notes. My name is Jonathan Kemp, and I'm the creator of Smart Wisdom, the advanced note-taking technique. I've been helping experienced professionals and students to manage information more effectively for the past 20 years. So, in this video, I'm gonna show you, whoops, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you a new way of recording information, um, whether you're listening to it or you're reading it. And it's going to be a new way of structuring. So the benefits of this new approach called Smart Wisdom is that it's gonna help you uh, gather information more effectively. You're going to be able to record 50% less without any loss of detail. You'll be able to understand what you're recording better as you record it. And there's an improvement, which is scientifically improven, of 20%. And finally, your recall is going to be that much better as well. Um, at the end of the video, I'm also going to give you some extra tips, which um, will help you also help you manage information more effectively. So uh, let's get going. I'm now going to just turn the video so you can see. Um, let's have a look. Can you see it? OK, so hopefully you can see this. There are some uh, there's a sentence here and the first step, which is to rather than recording everything which you see here, is you want to remove all the, uh, the small words, which we call the sort of glue words which bring everything together. So having a look at this sentence, there is a need for 15 new advisors to visit clients and make presentations. What do you think are the small words, the interconnecting words you could remove? Um, if I was doing it, I'd remove these. So there is A, I'd probably need four, and then probably two, and then and. And in this, in this instance, I want to keep a lot of the detail. Now, what I'm going to do is just fold this piece of paper over and show you what I would do using the Smart Wisdom methodology. So hopefully you can see that. Just move it over a bit more. go right so the uh, first step is then to remove all the words and then step two is to take the remaining information um, actually we can get rid of there as well I think take the remaining information and the third step is to then restructure it so very easy I would take the word need and then 15, um, and then the word new, and advisors. And as you can see, as I'm taking the, uh, the key information out, I am then restructuring it using these series of interconnected lines. Um, and then we go visit clients. And then the final bit is make presentations. Right. Now, a top tip for you um, is that wherever you get an and or an or, that is the time to break information up because there are two separate pieces of information and they will both relate to the previous to the previous word, which is often a noun or a verb. Now, another key aspect of the uh, of this technique, which increases productivity, is you can also read it as you're listening. So as a quick illustration, which do you find easier to read or listen? To, uh, sorry, which do you find easier to read this or the example below? Hopefully, even though it's early days, you'll, you'll find this a bit easier to read. Fantastic. So that's it. Um, the problem we all face is that the note-taking technique we were taught at school and we then use for all our study and in, when we go into work in the workplace is inefficient. Um, 
And what I've shown you is I've given you a solution. There are three easy steps. Um, the first is to remove any unnecessary information. Then you extract the important words that are left and then you reconnect them together. And that process means that you record less. Um, your understanding is much greater. And later on, whether it's weeks or months later, you are able to recall much more information. Whoops, upside down. <laughs> Get the hang of this soon. Um, so I've uh, put together some uh, tips for you to help you manage information more effectively. And as a final sort of bonus tip, remember when you're recording information, particularly when listening to others, I would recommend not starting too early because you need to know the content of what they're saying to be able to structure it properly. So see if you can wait a few seconds. Um, I hope you've liked this video and if you have, um, please do press click for like. Also feel free to comment and of course share it with anyone that you think would be interested or might find this helpful. Um, thank you very much for watching and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.